Hello friends, in this video I am going to show how to generate sign in button for different social media accounts. Also I will show how to generate custom sign in button. So make sure to watch the video till the end. If you have not yet subscribed my channel, please subscribe it for more helpful Flutter videos. Let's get started with blank Flutter project. Here I will be showing sign in button on the screens. To show sign in buttons, I will be using custom sign in buttons package. This package supports Android, iOS, web and desktop platforms. It is really easy to integrate. Let's make changes in main.dart file. As I will be showing multiple sign in buttons on the screen. So I will be using column widget here. Now inside this column widget, first let's add sign in button for Facebook. So for that I will be using sign in button widget. Inside this widget, we need to set button property and for this button property we can specify the value of type social media so here i will be selecting facebook this button is enum and inside this enum multiple values are added for different social media accounts here you can see support for apple discord email facebook and likewise for linkedin there are too many values are added here so this package supports all these social media accounts. Now let's show Facebook button here on the screen. Now you can see Facebook button is shown on the screen. We can set its height and width. So likewise you can change height and width using this width and height property. I will be removing height property here. Let's align this button. So I will wrap this column widget inside center widget. And let's put space between this app bar and button. So I will use size box widget here. Now let's customize this sign in with Facebook button. You can show more rounded corner for this button using border radius property I will show here border radius 30 it becomes more rounded as compared to earlier we can change size of this text using text size property here you can see text size is increased you can change size of this icon using icon size property so here this icon size is increased also you can show this button text in Spanish language using Spanish property so here we need to just make it true. Now here you can see this text is changed to Spanish language. Also you can change this text using text property. Now here you can see the text is changed. You can show this text in any language. You just have to provide the localized text here for this text property. Let's translate this text in French and paste here. So I will be passing this text to text property. Here you can see French text is shown on the button. Likewise you can customize this button. Also you can attach on press callback handler using on press property. Right now this button has white splash color. You can change it to any color using splash color property. So here I will be using red color. Now let's check. Here you can see this splash color is changed. Now it is red. Likewise, let's set button for Pinterest. I will be just copying this button code and I will paste below it. So here for this button property, I will specify Pinterest. I will remove this text and Spanish property. Now let's put space between these two buttons. So for that, I will be copying this size box widget. And I will paste between these two buttons. So here you can see the space is added between these two buttons. Now we have shown sign in buttons for Pinterest and Facebook. Likewise, you can add multiple sign in button for different social media accounts. This package supports multiple different social media accounts. As I have already shown this button in now, it supports multiple social media accounts. You can see complete list here. 
now if you don't want to show this text you can hide it using show text property here we can specify false then this text won't be displayed here you can see the text is disappeared i will set it to true to show text again now here we can specify the sign in buttons here without showing this text it will just show this icon so let's show the sign in button for twitter i will be copying this code as is and i don't want all this properties instead of all this properties i will just specify mini property true here you can see it just show the icon without any text beside this now if you want this button little bit bigger you can specify it using small property so instead of this mini property we can use small so likewise you can customize this social media sign in buttons now so far we have seen how to add sign in button for different social media accounts now let's set custom sign in button with custom sign in button i will be using custom sign in button widget here we can specify text using text property let's set icon using custom icon property here you can see email icon is shown with this text let's set width for this button let's change background color of this button to blue color now color is changed let's change text color this color is changed likewise we can change color of this icon using icon color property so instead of this blue color if you want to show gradient color for this button you can do it using use gradient property so for this use gradient we need to make true and there is another property set gradient using that we can set gradient color and here i will set linear gradient you can see here this color is change to gradient color here you can see multiple warnings so let's remove them first so using this package you can show multiple sign in buttons for different social media accounts you can customize them using various properties also you can create custom sign in button using custom sign in button widget that's all for this video this source code is available on git link is given in the description if you like this video please click on like button and do not forget to subscribe my channel